Hello and welcome, I'm your Code Monkey. The Asset Store is full of awesome tools and assets to help you make your own games. There's more and more awesome stuff coming out every month, so in this video, let's check out some of the highlights for January 2022. In this first video, I will be covering a list of free assets, and in the next ones, I will be covering paid assets and tools. Check out the following playlist to see all of the highlights every month. You might find something that would be perfect for whatever project you're currently working on. Let me know in the comments if you pick up any of these and what you intend to do with them. And by the way, check out my own assets on the store. So far I've made the free key door system, which is a super simple way to add keys and doors to your game, and the mouse cursor system pro, which is a very easy to use tool to help you create custom animated cursors to really make your game stand out. Alright, so starting off with a couple of low poly guns, it's a pistol and a rifle, it's a pretty nice low poly style, each model is rigged, so animating is super simple, they look great, and if you like this style, then this dev also has a complete pack. Or maybe you want some low poly environment, so here's one. It's got quite a lot of assets for a free pack. It's got mountains, trees, flowers, grass, rocks and tons more. They all look great and there's quite a bit of variety. Or maybe you're working on some kind of dungeon game, then check out this one. It's some really nice pixel art, very very tiny sprites. Features 45 dungeon tiles, that's quite a lot. Also has a hero and enemy characters, each of them with 7 unique pixel art animations. So this one could be great to start off your next prototype. And speaking of prototypes, if you need some textures, look at this one. It's a collection of pre-made simple textures and materials to easily identify objects in your prototypes. So use them to visualize colliders and triggers, easily measure distances and test out reflections. It's made for working with ProBuilder, so this one truly is excellent for prototyping. Then if you're working on a JRPG inspired game, check out this character. Very nice, very high quality character with a cute art style. Really nice helmet and a very deadly spear. Comes with 5 animations so it's all ready to play. Then for an interesting tool, here is Runtime Utilities. It's a collection of extension methods and various utilities. It seems to be made by a professional developer, it's all open source and very well tested. If you're working on a car game, here's a bunch of cartoony cars. They look very nice, very cute. Features 4 unique cars and 12 textures for quite a lot of variation. If you have some low poly car idea you've been thinking about, maybe a traffic management game or maybe a simple racer, then this can be quite useful. Up next, here's a simple one that does exactly what it says, a bunch of circular health bars. Easily customize the thickness and how many separators you want. It looks really simple, just add one script and that's it. So this one could be interesting if you're tired of some boring rectangular health bars. If you're working on a side-scrolling shooter, then here's a bunch of weapons. They're all very well drawn, I quite like this style. Features quite a lot of weapons for a free pack. You've got a bunch of rifles, pistols and shotguns, even an RPG, a knife and some shells and grenades. And finally, for another interesting tool, over here is Easy Notes. It's pretty simple, you just add a component and you can add notes to your objects. Maybe for something you want to do in the future, so maybe a to-do list, or just remind yourself of what a specific game object does. So it's pretty simple, and there's also a menu to view all of the notes at once. Alright, so those are my top 10 free new assets on the Unity Asset Store for January 2022. There's links to all in the description, stay tuned for the next videos covering paid assets and tools, there's lots of awesome stuff there. Check out the phone playlist to see more lists with free and paid assets, and let me know if you pick up any of these and what you intend to do with them. Also check out my own free and paid assets on the store. Alright, hope that's useful, check out these videos to learn some more. Thanks to these awesome Patreon supporters for making these videos possible. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.